I'm a Jonas Charlie. Some outstanding things about me are my comedy career, geography degree, and debt. <laughs> Being a comedian and a student has taken me to places like America and the Netherlands, and it has kept me out of my family home for years. I feel like my family barely knows who I am at this point. But now in the age of quarantine, I am ready to start these emotional connections going again. So I'm gonna shake things up by announcing that. So I'm black, I'm gay, as evidenced by my attire and the fact that I'm rollerblading the most homosexual form of transportation. I plan to come out to each member of my family one by one. Problem is, it's a bit tough to wrangle all of these folks together. My younger brother Elijah pays more attention to Fortnite than me. My younger sister Majesty is an aspiring Instagram influencer, which already makes her at least buy. And I don't know what my older sister does, but I respect sibling hierarchy. I'm actually pretty excited to hear what my siblings have to say. It's really tough to get an emotional reaction out of them, so I wanna see what I can do. So, hi. Hi. We're related, right? Yes. Being related, I thought it'd be important to keep in touch and stay close. Despite the fact that I've been mostly out of the house for the past five years, I wanted to come home and reconnect physically and emotionally. So I wanted to share something really important about me that you may not know, but here it is. I'm gay. Okay. Is that it? I don't know, like, I'm supportive, I guess. You are? Yeah. Did you tell mom? I like the way you said that. Uh-huh. Real assertive. Real assertive? Like, I'm, am I take not? Take it or leave it, this is what I am. Am I not assertive all the time? No. Like, if you were gay, well, are gay. Mm-hmm, it's confirmed. Yeah, that's cool to me, because I don't have any hard feelings towards those homosexuals at all. Mm -hmm. like, like they're cool people, I like them. Because I didn't expect it. You didn't expect it? No. That's the most surprising thing so far. To me, at least. Would you consider yourself heterosexual? <laughs> what is sexuality? I consider myself majestic. Jesus Christ. <laughs> So far, so not bad. I mean, this was the easy part. They're all young, they get it. And I'm glad to have captured reactions ranging from flustered to shocked to whatever Majesty was doing. So that was cool. Um, but I am a little bit concerned about one point that each of them brought up. And that's the point that my mom's well, she is from Guyana, where homosexuality is still a punishable crime today, but I did inadvertently come out to her a few years ago. So I'm gonna assume that she's grown to become more and more accepting over the time she's had to think about this. So I'll come out to her again, officially, on my own terms, and I'll do it during a beautiful, serene trip to Lake Simcoe on a boat ride driven by her partner, CJ. I had initially thought that I would take this opportunity <laughs> Up to my mom while we were on the still waters of Lake Simcoe. Problem is, the waters aren't so still, so we are rushing back home where hopefully we can get back home so that I can still do this interview on time. So 
let's just hope we survive this mess. <laughs> oh, all right, here we go. Okay, so I'm just gonna come out and say it. Oh, wow. I'm, okay, okay, okay. I'm gay. And that's what this interview is about. I don't know what you want me to say. I want you to say how you feel. When I did interviews with Elijah, Majesty, and Soraya, they all described you as homophobic. That's their opinion. That's their opinion? That's how they see me, I guess. Is that how the you way see? I was brought up is like, you know, that's not what I see for you. That's not what I wanted for you. So, and what did you want? I wanted to see if you were more accepting now more than before. I choose not to accept it for you. Why not? It makes me better. It makes you better? Yes. How? given me a point of view that's more interesting than your generic heterosexual narrative. It's empowered me personally and given me a lot of independence that I wouldn't have otherwise. What? It's made me better than I would be otherwise. You honestly think it made you better. See? It's a choice. It's you not. Mean? Why would I choose this? And when I just you... wish, I just wish you had come to me when you first start experiencing certain things. You should have come to me. You signaled to me that you had harmful sentiment, sentiment towards... That's how... People like me. Caribbean people talk. That's how you felt. You were smart enough to know that I didn't meant that I would literally kill you. But I'm also smart enough to know that why bother taking the risk when I could just wait until things are less dangerous. <laughs> I could still kill you. <laughs> I dare you. I've, I've grown so much stronger since <laughs> Really now? Do you think I'm a top or a bottom? Kind of. <laughs> Have you not even thought about it? Listen, I don't even want to think about that. Of course you have. I know, I know you have. You're obsessed. I am not obsessed. You're obsessed. Ugh, God. Well, well what? Do you love me? You still love me. Of course I still love you. It doesn't change my love for you. You know that. Mm -hmm. hmm. You'll come around. Honestly, I do wish she would embrace my sexuality a bit more, but I'm not disappointed. These are complicated feelings to grapple with, and I think what's most important is that she accepts me as her son, and I accept who she is. This family has grown so independent that we have trouble letting others in. And maybe that's why I feel so disconnected. Yet, that self-determination also brings us great things, and it's what gave me the strength to come out to my family. And when we do come together, it's a magical time. Our personalities shine, and I'm reminded how we're all cut from the same cloth. Over the years, I've really come to understand who I am, and now I think my family understands too. And even though there's been so much distance between us, I've never felt closer to my family. Okay, that's it. <laughs>